I am going to rank all of the legendary pets in Adopt Me from best to worst to find out the most hated Adopt Me legendaries and the best. Let's start off with the squid. I'm gonna say that this is good. Tiger, yeah, this one's definitely going top tier because, you know, my logo is a tiger. The sugar glider, don't think this should have been a legendary. I'm saying it's bad. Oh, by the way, there is a bunch of pets that we need to go through. And the diamond unicorn, since it's literally just a re colored version of the unicorn it's going in the bad section the albatross again i don't really like the pet so it's kind of gonna have to go there and believe it or not there is two types of albatross so i guess they're going together arctic reindeer i am saying is great it was one of my first legendaries that i made into a mega the minion chick i think this is a pretty underrated pet i'm gonna say that it's good because it's a chick and it's it's a minion, so you can't go wrong. The golden chow chow, I'm gonna say okay. It just seems very strangely golden, you know. Penguin, I'm also just gonna chuck it in the okay section. I opened a hundred of these, and it turns out that they actually said the odds were wrong. So I'm keeping him here. Alongside the golden one, I think the golden and the diamond should just be next to each other. Up next, a diamond griffin. Yeah, he's going in the bad slot. No one likes the griffin. A peacock. Now, this one actually has a pretty nice design, and I do like it. So, this one's going in the good section. The lava dragon. This one's actually a really nice pet. So, I'm putting it as a great. Not really many people bought this pet, to be honest. The winged horse. I don't know. I think that's... I don't know where to put it, guys. Let me know. Am I wrong? By the way, this is all based off of my opinion, so feel free to disagree. The jousting horse. I'm going to say this one's pretty good. I do like the design of it, and it looks pretty cool. The shark. Pretty nice design. It's simple. It makes sense. So we're going to stick the shark and the octopus next to each other. This one is probably one of my favorite designs. So the strawberry shortcake bat dragon definitely has to be the top of the top. This pony I spent so long trying to get and it's 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 okay I guess it's a pony. The Nessie pet, I don't know if you can still buy it, but I'm just gonna chuck it in the okay section. Again, I'm not too fussed about this pet. Up next is the Wings Tiger, which is pretty much the same as the other tiger, but they chuck some wings on it. And as I said, I think I have to say they're the best since my logo is a tiger. The moon bat, I'm gonna say this one's good. I did like the design of this. Up next, the monkey king. Yeah, I, I'm gonna say this one's pretty good, actually. The same for this monkey, I'm gonna say it's great. I just love the full neon glow when like the pet just fully glows white neon. A turtle, yeah, this one's gonna be good. I don't know what's gonna go in the worst section. I guess we can do some re- Actually, I know what's going in the worst section. This, this is going in the worst section. Another pet that definitely deserves to go in the worst section, I think is the golden scarab. Don't ask me why, I just don't really like it. Then I guess this dragon can go next to the trio of these three, by the way. Way. The Phoenix, this one's such a nice neon, so I'm gonna put this in the great section. This owl, pretty nice, but not as nice as the original owl, so I'll stick it in the good. The Shadow Dragon, yeah, this one's gotta be the best of the best. It's literally the most hyped up pet in the game. Are you trying to find your own Shadow Dragon? Let me introduce you to Blocks Trade, a virtual marketplace where you can post your Adopt Me trades. You can create your own listings and request specific pets that you're after or let people even make you offers. This app will save you tons of time searching through servers to find the perfect trade. It's up to date and features all of the brand new pets and items that are added into the game. Check out Blocks Trade today, I've left the link in the description. To find your best Adopt Me trade. A golden dragon, I don't know, I kinda like it, but I should probably just chuck it in the bad. I'm also chucking this guy down in the worst, I, I just don't like the ladybugs. This golden rat literally used to be one of the most hated pets in the game, but I never really minded it, and it wasn't my favorite, so we'll chuck it in the okay section. The diamond unicorn, that can go right next to this guy. The dodo, oh I do like the dodo to be fair, so we'll chuck you in the good bit. Actually, you know what, let's put it in the great section, because the Fossil Isles update was literally the best update ever in Adopt Me. Kangaroo, um, yeah, you can go next to this this pile, I guess. Uh, Golden Griffin, sorry, mate, you're going down. 
the Skelly Rex. This one's a pretty underrated pet. Not many people talked about this and not many people even have this pet. Golden Penguin, to be fair, I do actually like the design of this penguin, so I'm going to put him up in the good section. Cerberus, I'm going to say is okay. I mean, it should have just been a Halloween-only pet, but they are removing it right now, I guess. Queen Bee, again, one of my first ever Mega Neons that I got, so I'll keep that here. Frost Fury, yeah, I do like the design of this. It's going up here as well. The Summer Walrus, I don't know why it's called a Summer Walrus. It's literally just a Walrus, so it's going in the worst section possible. T-Rex, as I said, amazing update that it came from, so that's gonna go in the great section. The Ninja Monkey, let's say that it's okay and chuck it here. This Ice Golem, again, a pretty underrated pet. Not many people were really excited about this, but I do like the design of it, so I think I'm gonna put it in the great section. The classic red dragon this has just got to be an okay one the mummy cat i do like it it's a cat obviously i'm putting that quite high up the list oh the giraffe one of my favorite pets that's definitely got to go in the best section the parrot again i love the red on it it's definitely going in the top section possible the owl oh this is so hard to decide does it go in the best or the great let's keep it in the great for now I can't believe I haven't done the unicorn yet. I'm going to say the unicorn is just okay. Robo dog. Um, yeah, let's chuck it here as well. That leaves a few pets left. The axolotl wasn't really a fan of it. The evil unicorn. Yeah, I guess this one's pretty good. I like the whole style of evil pets. The crow. Again, that's a pretty good pet. Do we put it here or here? I'm going to say it's great. It's a nice design. And again, it's neon is great. Oh, the straight up normal bat dragon. That's definitely got to be the best of the best. Same for the frost dragon. I actually don't have a frost dragon in Adopt Me anymore. I gave them all away and I traded them. So I actually don't have that pet anymore. And that leaves us with one pet left. The last pet on the list is a gold horn. So I'm just going to say that it's okay. Since we've now gone and done all of the pets, there's actually some eggs to go and play, so let's quickly go and rank these eggs. I'm gonna base this off of how the egg looks, not what pets are inside. I think the ocean egg was pretty decent, to be fair. The golden egg, pretty generic. I mean, they just stuck gold on their basic egg. Same for this minion chick egg. It's just kind of really boring. It's just a plain egg. Woodland egg, I'd say it's pretty good. Aussie egg, I'm gonna also say that's a good egg. Fossil egg, yeah, I like this one pretty well. Farm egg, again, it's a cool egg. The fiery egg, I'm gonna put this in good. Mythic egg, um, let's, let's go good as well. And then the royal egg, I'm just gonna say that it's okay. Now let me know what is your favorite Adopt Me pet in the comments. And if you think I should rank every single Adopt Me pet in existence. Click this video here to see me buy every single Roblox Adopt Me toy possible. I opened a ton of the plushies and I think you'll like it. And check out my merch shop called madebycookie.com where you can go and get your own neon hats or products featuring my logo on them.